Hello there, my name is Azure Media, but you can just call me Callie or Cow for short. Uh, keep in mind that I am simply recording this on my phone, so the audio is probably really bad, but it, it's fine. It, it's fine. Today, I've decided to do the clan generator challenge that's been going around YouTube because it looked like a lot of fun. Before I begin, just note that I loosely follow descriptions of the cat given to me. I plan to possibly animate these cats, and I wanted to have them, you know, have, like, simple designs, so I don't die while I draw the markings. Yeah, most of this clan ended up being tabbies and tortoiseshells, so I just tried to simplify them as much as I could. I was still trying to make, make them look like tabbies and stuff, so yeah, keep that in mind. The clan I generated is named Cliff Clan, and they were described as egotistical and sassy, so I chose to make that reputation that the clan has based on the actions of the warriors and apprentices of the clan. The older cats are a lot more calm and friendly towards the neighboring clan, Lowland Clan. So, let's get started with the leader of Cliff Clan, Cormorant Star. Unfortunately, the speed paint for her got messed up, so I'll just put her design on the screen and just talk about her. Cormorant Star was described as a black she-cat with short fur and copper eyes. I did not make her solid black, and I ended up giving her some longer fur than I originally planned to, but I still really love how she turned out. Cormorant is one of the oldest cats in her clan, and she still has five of her nine lives left. She's been the leader for many, many moons, and she's well respected, despite how misbehaved her clan can be. Her mate is Sandtail, and together they have two kits, Crowpaw and Shadowpaw. I don't have much else to say about her, so let's move on to the deputy. The deputy of Cliff Clan is Laburnum Heart. She was described as a cream classic pseudo tabby she cat with short fur and green eyes. Laburnum is also an older cat of Cliff Clan, who has served as Cormorant's deputy throughout her entire leadership. She is a sister of Sandtail and one of Cormorant Star's best friends. She never took on a mate or had any kits of her own, but she used to help the queens take care of their kits back when she was a younger warrior. Next up is the medicine cat, Thrift Pelt. He was described as a red-spotted tabby tom with short fur and yellow eyes, but I ended up not making them resemble a spotted tabby, like, at all. Thrift Pelt is a very reserved and quiet cat preferring to heal cats quickly and efficiently rather than have long conversations. The only cat he really enjoys talking to is Redstone, Lowland Clan's medicine cat. The two of them can usually be found chatting away at gatherings, sharing the latest news about their clans. Rift Pout has not taken on an apprentice yet, but he hopes that when Ravenleg's litter comes, one of them will be fit to join him in the medicine den. Welp, that's all I'm doing for this part. The next part, I will be going over all seven of Cliff Clan's warriors. Not sure when I'll get the next part up, but hopefully it won't be too long. Thank you for watching, and I hope you enjoyed!